More than six oil tankers now anchored offshore in Hebron Town, a source of frustration for Assistant Fisheries Superintendent Clement Cal Campbell. Campbell telling ZNS News this afternoon that he believes the tankers could be doing serious damage to the reef in that area. He contends that the tankers are being allowed to anchor a mile offshore, which he says is a bit too close for comfort. All of them are anchor, and then they drop the anchor down, and that's a drag at least. 40 to 50 feet before it gets a grip. So it damages up all the ground, the seabed. So and it takes forever for that to grow back. This is so wrong. They can't do this in Texas. They can't do this in New Louisiana or nowhere where there's oil, oil field. So I asked Volpac or Broco to take these seven oil boats they have out here out for the ocean, at least five or six miles out. Assistant Fisheries Superintendent is adamant that the tankers should not be anchored so close to shore. Campbell says he has received numerous complaints from fishermen in that district who feel their livelihood may be threatened. Because I know what an anchor does when you drop it. It drags and drags and drags. And those boat weigh more than, what, 200,000 tons or something like that? And, they pull it, and then the breeze is 25 or 30 knots. That's more pressure on it pulling it in, in this way. So there's lots of damage can be done with this. And I, just, I just ask them to move it, you know. It doesn't look good, and I don't like it, and, and the persons living in this area don't like it. Because there's a group of men just left here about 10 minutes ago. They're upset about it. They just were sitting here. And I asked them what they think about it. They said, this is wrong. Now, if they could see this, the powers to be should be able to see the same thing. You know, and, I, and by airing this, I hope that the persons see this, who are in charge, take some action. By tomorrow morning, these boats will be out at least five or ten miles out, and those anchor be up off the reef. With an official from Borco who says while they appreciate the concerns as it relates to the fishing grounds, the tankers are anchored a mile and a half offshore, which is a continental shelf designated for anchorage on maritime charts. He says the anchorage area is clearly set out on maritime maps that is controlled by the government's port department.